Hi. Today I'm going to be going over how we can make changes to our WordPress website. Now a WordPress website can look like any other website. We can actually change the themes, the functionality and the look. So you wouldn't even realize that it is actually a WordPress website. Now some of the features that we can change with our website typically are going to be the content on the pages. We can add new pages to our menu bar. We could add sub menu pages. We can add blogs. We could add a photo gallery or various other photos that are already inside the gallery. We have what's called widgets which sit on the right hand side of our website typically. And here I just have a couple of widgets installed. One of them is a calendar widget. The other is a members login widget so we can restrict who has access to our website. But in order to make any of these changes and add any new bits and pieces, we must first log into the dashboard of our WordPress website. So we simply do that by going up to our website name in the address bar here, and at the very end of it, after the forward slash, we type in wp-admin, and we simply click on enter. And this will take us to the login page. Now at this point we put in our username and our password and we select login and this will take us to our dashboard and here it is here our dashboard now from this dashboard we can modify every aspect of our website so we can add new posts pages categories tags we can add new comments we can approve comments we can also see how many comments may be pending and how many have already been spammed on the left hand side we can modify the theme of our website. We can add some widgets, we can add some extra plugins to our website and there's also a whole range of other features and functions that we can change and add to our website. But for now we're just going to look at the dashboard and where we need to go to add new pages or posts. 